Yes, people, this is um, Patel here. I am at Cherry Hill once more and I am overlooking the town of Chatibile and it is evident that an eruption is possible. If you look, you can see fire at the rim of the crater. As if you look at the center of my video, there is fire at the rim of the crater. In the meantime, an evacuation order has been issued for people who are living in the red zone. I understand that is from Chatibile, Fitus, Richmond, and possible Petit Bordel. As you can see in the harbor in Chatibile is the boat Gemstar waiting to evacuate people. Some persons have left on their own accord using private vehicles and so on. From Petit Bordel, the neighboring village from where I am belonging to, some people are on the road looking for a ride to take them to Kingston. We have been told that there are persons or vehicles coming, but so far no buses have arrived. But let me just draw your attention once more to the Lasso Fred. Here, yeah, let me zoom in a bit. And as you can see, that is fire at the rim of the crater. Now, what is interesting, you know, the fire is not at the top, but is a little below the rim. And I am wondering to myself what can cause that fire to be below the rim and not on the rim. I don't know if there is something being broken away there or, or something like that. But we don't know. So we're keeping our fingers crossed. Yes, we can clearly say now, based on the fact that we are seeing fire, that the Lassoufre volcano is in fact erupting. It is doing so and have been doing so since, since today in a... I wouldn't say a violent manner, but we have seen videos taken from the crater area where a brave young lad was there taking some photos and we saw the smoke coming out from the crater itself, which in my estimation, in that of others, it has to be a, an eruption. So, Chatibule people, the boat Gemstar has just docked in at the wharf. You can see it there in the middle of your screen and the people are getting ready to go on to the boat also many vans private vehicles cars and trucks but you name it people are going out of chatibile fitus and those surrounding areas the red zone a lot the red zone the declaration of um of the evacuation notice the evacuation order has been given and persons from the chatibile area are evacuating Chatibule, Fitzhugh, Spetibadil and other areas. As a matter of fact, throughout North Bay, what people are taking it on their own and they are doing their own evacuation. So we have Gemstar, as I said, in the harbor. And right now, well, the summit of the Sufre, and we have not seen any fires anymore, but they are there. You might not be able to see the little specks on my video, which the quality is not of the best, but you can understand what I'm talking about. There is fire around the crater rim volcano is erupting it is not doing so violently because we are not seeing the big mushroom smoke that that is usually associated with volcanic eruption but we are seeing smoke emanating from where the crater is supposed to be and i am doing that from the center of my video you can see where the crater is and you have um, smoke coming from that area the, the evacuation order has been given north leeward in the red zone areas, Walibo, Bridgeman, Fitus, Chatibule, Petit Bordel, people are on the move. They are finding whatever transportation is available area to a point of safety. I encourage the person to do so, even though their area has not been fully given the orders yet, but they can do so if they if that is to put their mind at ease and they want to get out of North Leeward which we are in the red and orange zone. So as I said once more, the, the, the um, Gemstar is at port. I am not seeing any busy traffic of people going onto the boat, but people are checking on. And um, maybe some have gotten the message late. Some have already taken alternative transportation and they are getting out to a place of safety. I am urging persons coming into North Leeward for their relatives, their loved ones to be very extra careful on the road. I have been saying that in Chatibile, for example, 
we have to take the road through the planned village area, a very narrow road indeed, and persons have to be careful how they maneuver that narrow road that is only, in my opinion, for, for um, one-way traffic. Now, here we see again some fires coming from the crater. And if you can see, let me just try to zoom some more. Yes, there's, that's, there it is, fire again from the rim of the crater. And I am not sure what is causing that. If something is overflowing, if something is coming from just below the rim, but fire is at the Lassoufre crater. Persons viewing this can attest to that fact. It is at the center of your screen. Might not be so visible now. There's a little bit of cloud cover by there. But yes, you can see the fire emanating from Lassoufre volcano at the moment. And people are clearing out of it. Chatibile, Richmond, Pettibodel, surrounding areas. People are going to save the grounds. We are not sure as to the the um the type of eruption that we are gonna have is it gonna be something like in 79 when we have a big gush of smoke and molten materials coming from within the old cross and cause a big explosion or such or it's gonna be continue oozing out that we are experiencing now because as i said to you yes and we have people now as you can see i don't know if i could zoom in a bit but people are checking on to the to, to um to the the gem star that is at chatibale harbor and um looking to get to the safe zone so i am here at cherry hill overlooking the town of chatibale where the last of is in the back and fire is coming from the crater also there is a boat in the harbor gemstar evacuating people from the red zone i am in and of cherry hill that's overlooking the town of chateau and also having the last of right across here it is again the fire glowing in the, in the dark night La Soufrière is in action, people. You know, um, I, I was a, a youngster in 1979 and I remember vividly we, ha we had a morning um, evacuation starting from early o'clock in the morning. But tonight we seem to be have to do it in the night because that is when the order was given late um, early this, this afternoon and persons are busy. Some people would have um, packed from before and for them it's just a matter of moving out. Some people move out the elderly citizens and so on get them out of harm's way children have been sent out to meet relatives and family in safe zones and others are now moving out as well so here we are i said we are in chatebile and um well overlooking chateau that is and as i said to you before the last of Ray, as you can see in the background those things that look like stars is in the background those are fire emanating from the crater itself of the La Soufrière volcano. I, I see that we have a lot of people on the live. I, I, I cannot respond to any of you because I have a commentating and videotaping at the same time so I wouldn't be able to respond to any comments but I will go through them and, and thanks persons for their advice to be safe and whatnot and so on and so forth. But you know as I said our people in North Leeward we are a resilient people. We have guts like bully and we're going to get through this you know if we have to move then we have to move and um we are accustomed to this 79 most of us around my age group and a little younger than me had the experience of the that eruption and we had to flee to to um other places of safety we didn't have the technology that we have now we didn't have big boats coming into north leeward we didn't have the kind of transportation and media coverage that we have now we didn't have all the social media platform to send messages and receive messages things are a bit different now and i believe that the evacuation plan would be would, would um go much easier this time around because people for a long time since last December they have been getting signals and signs that a new option is imminent. You know, as I as I'm speaking, you can see the, the the glow in the back, the, the glow are getting bigger. The glow in the back is getting bigger. There are two major patch there of, of, of fire. Right, is, that is from the crater. I, as I said before, I don't know if it's something overflowing and I don't know if it's something cracked from just below this, the, 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 the summit. But fire is evident at La Soufrière crater. While that is happening, the evacuation of persons in Chatibile is taking place. The boat is in the harbor and um, people are going to the boat. In the meantime, I, I, um, I just came from my hometown of Petit Bordel where they are waiting on vans to take them out as they were told to do. They are assembling in Petty, but on the main road next to the playing field waiting. When I left there a few minutes ago, there was no vans, even though they were told they were getting vans over an hour ago. But I guess that 
coming into North Leeward could be a bit tricky with a lot of vehicles going out and I owe drivers again to be extra careful on our road. It's a narrow road and everyone is trying to get out. So wild vans are coming in to rescue or to take out people from these parts. So my advice to people, drive carefully. If you don't have to come into North Leeward, please don't come. Let us um, have an easy fluff traffic. And um, as I said, we have the glow of the volcano in the back. We saw, we have seen fires, fire em emanating from the crater. And at the same time, in the harbor of Chatibile, we are witnessing an evacuation in process. I think that the Coast Guard is also in the harbor there as well. I saw it coming up a while ago, just behind Gemstar. And I guess they are there for, to assist in any way that they possibly can. So, I give you a little tidbit of what is happening here in North Leeward. In the town of Chatibile, in the red zone where evacuation is on the way. So for the time being, this is Patel signing off with this latest video of what is happening. And it is coming live to you from Chateau. Thanks very much for viewing. And if the need be, I could come again later on. It might not be from this very spot. It might be from somewhere else where I can give further updates of what is happening right here in Northleywood.